In case you missed it, the Washington State University Cougars are headed to San Antonio for the Alamo Bowl. The Cougs will take on Iowa State. It takes place Friday, December 28th. The game kicks off at 6 p.m. Huge part of the Cougs' success this season is due to Gardner Minshew. The Mississippi Mustache, as he's called, <laughs> threw for nearly 4,500 yards and 36 touchdowns this season. Despite those numbers, Minshew was not among the top three Heisman Trophy candidates just announced today. Creme 2's Brenna Green caught up with Minshew to talk Heisman and the upcoming bowl game. We suspected it could happen after the Washington game, but today we found out for sure. After a season where Gardner Minshew's Heisman stock only seemed to rise and rise, one game eventually doomed him from making the trip to New York City. Minshew was not named a Heisman finalist tonight, while Alabama's Tua Tagovailoa, Ohio State's Dwayne Haskins, and Oklahoma's Kyler Murray all got the nod. Minshew ended the season second in the entire FBS in terms of passing yards and finished first in average passing yards per game, but that was not enough in the eyes of the Heisman voters. Mainly the issue was Minshew's game against Washington, where he went 26 of 35 for 152 yards, had no touchdowns, and two interceptions. I sat down with Minshew earlier today before he knew whether or not he got to go to the Heisman ceremony. And here are his thoughts if he did and if he didn't end up going to New York City. Oh, I'll be I'll be excited to go. Um, you know, I think I'll have a lot of fun. I will have a blast up there, you know, with Coach Leach. Uh, just go see New York. Never been there. Uh, if not, it's no big deal. You know, um, I'm going to go have a great time in Atlanta. Uh, come back and get, get right back to work for a uh, bowl prep. However, not all bad news for Minshew this Monday as he did receive the Johnny Unitas Golden Arm Award, which is given to the nation's top senior or fourth year junior quarterback who best exemplifies character, scholastic and athletic achievement. Just because Minshew isn't headed to New York City doesn't mean he's not up for some other pretty big awards, namely the Davy O'Brien Award given to the nation's top quarterback and the Walter Camp Award given to the nation's top player. Those awards will be presented at the College Football Awards in Atlanta on Thursday. Thursday as Minshew talked about in that last soundbite and he's definitely looking forward to making the trip back east. My family's going to come up. That's going to be really cool. Glad they're going to be able to be a part of that. I think it's going to be a fun time. Get to connect with some of these guys that um, you know I've you know maybe talked to here or there but um, you know really get down and you know get to know them. I think it's going to be a great experience. One more thing to watch out for tomorrow. The all pack 12 teams will be announced and Gardner looks to be a shoe in for the all pack 12 first team. Just a reminder, none of this was expected of Minshew to start the season. So this has just been an incredible journey regardless of the results. Reporting in Pullman, I'm Brenna Green, Crem2 Sports. Yeah,